Hey, what's up y'all? Back with another video. And today I'm going to be making this frozen blood orange amaretto sour. So the first thing you want to do is start off with your amaretto part, which is this Italian liqueur. And it's actually made with almonds and it really has this nice nutty, toasty, almond-like kind of flavor. And I'm also pairing that with this blood orange mixer. It's really, really, really sour and it's similar to that um, sweet and sour mixer that you would have in the traditional amaretto sour. So first you want to make sure that you shake up that mixer. And then you want to go in with four ounces of the amaretto liqueur. And after that, you just want to pour it in your blender. I have a Vitamix. Let me know if you want to see like, in, like a tutorial or review for the Vitamix, let me know. And also you want to go in with eight ounces of your blood orange mixer. So for traditional amaretto sours, the ratio is one part liqueur to two parts of the sour part. And I actually went in with a little splash of that sweet and sour mix. That's like the traditional pairing with the amaretto sours. And I just really, really like that, um, the sourness of it. So then I'm gonna go in with four cups of ice. And after that, y'all, that is pretty simple. You just wanna just blitz it all up in your blender until it is nice and frothy, nice and, I guess, slushy-like. And when it reaches that consistency, you know you are good to go. One thing to note, you might have to play around with the amount of ice you put in. At first, I only had about like two and a half cups or three cups, and it wasn't as slushy like as I wanted it to be. So then I just went in with a little bit more ice. So do that. I will say start off with about three and a half to four cups, and then if you need more, definitely do that. So now, y'all, it is really just time to <laughs> drink this thing and pour it all up, serve it all up. So because this is a blood orange amaretto sour, I decided to just put a little bit of oranges inside just to let you know that they're, you know, it's orange, orangey kind of flavor. And y'all, I really kind of just created this idea because I love blood orange anything, any sort of like drink. I love it when it's like has a blood orange flavor or even like a grapefruit flavor. I really love that play between like the bitter and the sweet and blood orange. That blood orange mixer definitely, definitely does the trick. So y'all, I really, really, really hope you enjoyed this quick recipe. As you see, it's really, really quick, really, really simple. And yeah, let me know what you think about it in the comments down below. And this is a perfect drink for those who don't really like to drink, honestly. It's a perfect introduction to drinks. All right, y'all, that's all I have for y'all today. I hope you like it. And let me know what you think down in the comments. Later.